Come back everyone, it is time for heat number three, the pre-final of the Cadet 12's SQ Series round number three. Cadet 12's led out by Jack Wells, the Ormo Flyer, Wellsy. Alongside him, Lockie Platten, Vidler and Bromhead on the next row. Then Lima Sunier and Santin. Kaiser Suffolk and Caden Thompson, then Connor Peacock and Jaden O'Day, and Jackson Greenhouse and Cody Anderson. Unfortunately, we are missing Jordan Sell, whose car just stopped. Watch out for that number 55, the Castrol sponsored Connor Peacock, who had a foul plug yesterday and will definitely be on the pace. He will be up with those front four. So watch for what he can do. Mikael Lima Surrier had a cracker end to the day yesterday. Whatever change he's made, and it's I think a return pipe of some sort, whatever it was, he is now on the money. What will he do? Do we go green light racing? 13 laps on the board, yes we do! Wellsy gets the whole shot, and yet again, Bromhead got a cracker. Bromhead through the second. He is having diamond starts. And Mika Limassurier has gone up to fourth. We'll tell you who else is there afterwards, but Platten has settled for third as they go through better bends for the first flying lap. Back towards me they come. Watch for moves being made in chaos. Early doors. This is where the action is. Through the chicane they come. Led by Wellesley, the Ormo flyer. Through they go. Stanton approaches right there with Kaiser Suffolk. Connor Peacock still on the back of him. Trying to punch through those. Punch through the air of those carts in front as they come down, sinking straight to complete the first flying lap. Mika Limassurier now on the back of the front four. Vidler and Santin just behind him. Vidler, will Vidler move up? He fancies it this time. He is quick around Warwick as they go down Broderick's through the right-hander, into better bends they go. It is Wells, Bromhead, Platten, Lima Surrier, Vidler, Santin, Thompson, Suffolk, Peacock, O'Day, Anderson, and Greenhouse at the moment. Back towards me they come, through Chaos Corner, and the inside, Santin! Santin's got two on Vidler! Santin holds it up there, yes he does! Ray Santin in an interview this morning sounded very confident and rightly so. He's got past Fiddler, but Fiddler gives it back side by side all the way into pit. Three wide. Oh, goodness me. Thompson, he very nearly made it a three way. And now for his trouble, he's lost the spot to Kaiser. Kaiser went through, caught him napping, saw it happening, and just breezes up on the inside. Boy, oh boy, they are on it today. The front four, though. Away they come. Down towards me, Mikkel Imasurier on the back of Wellesley, Bromet, Platten. Through they go. All gone through chaos. And now Santin gets in front. A fiddler. Kaiser Suffolk there with him. Connor Peacock's made in a five-way. He's on the back of that group and right with them. Looking over the shoulder there was Connor. Still looking who's in front and who's in front behind. Caden Thompson, hard on the brakes on the back of those three. But up front, the front three, eking away from Mika Limassurier. And they go through the right-hander into better bends. They will surely be coming back towards us, and it is by far from sorted. This could still get very, very tasty indeed. Back they come through the chicane. Bromhead looks tight, doesn't go. Neither does Fiddler. Kaiser Suffolk and Thompson. Thompson got there with it. And there's a move in the yes, there is. Oh, look at the battle in the back. Boy, oh boy, Anderson and Greenhouse. They were side by side all the way through Chaos Corner. And now Greenhouse right on the back of Anderson. Down they go through Sinkins and Greenhouse. Oh, he thought about it. Greenhouse had a little look. Doesn't go through and yields on the brakes. Anderson though, holding him off still. Greenhouse through across the corner. Down towards Broderick's they go. That is for last place, remember. They are really on it. Back towards us come the leaders. Wellesley from Bromet. Platten though, looks racy. Still doesn't go. Still not making the move. Ah, oh, Thompson 
Thompson nearly into the back of Kaiser. Kaiser Suffolk would have felt it. Still Greenhouse giving it some tangle as the leaders are already in the sinking. Eight laps to go. Look at Platten. Platten now. Right with her. Platten doesn't go through. Closed up on the brakes. Thompson had another look. Still doesn't get through. And now Peacock. He is right with Thompson. Right on his tail. Now they go to Broderick's down that short back straight. Four at the front. Five behind them. Still at it. And Greenhouse and Anderson are still ragging each other to death. Through they go. Into better bends. But back towards me. Wellesley Bromet. And Platter. Then Mimasulia. And then it's still all on. Sanson. Just in front of your man Fiddler. We suffered. And Thompson and Peacock. And side by side yet again. Greenhouse and Anderson. Boy, oh boy, we can watch them on their own for the old race. This is madness. Down sinking straight they go. Anderson and Greenhouse. Greenhouse closes up all the way through Electro. Greenhouse. Oh, he's almost touched. Very nearly sideways. He has had a talking to. He is just going to give it some jangle. Down they come into Broderick's for the leaders. Back towards me. Here comes Wellesley, the Ormo Flyer. Run on his tail, Bo Bromet. And Platten still there. Right with him. Who they go. Nothing to do behind. Oh, Kaiser. Kaiser Suffolk. He's got past Fiddler. Suffolk's up one. Fiddler back one. And still oh, Greenhouse and Anderson. Boy, oh boy. They are mental. On we go then, back with the leaders. Already into pit corner, and it's still on between those Kaiser, Suffolk, Thompson, and Fiddler trio. Either side of them, it's Connor Peacock just behind, trying to take advantage of whatever goes on. Six laps left to go still, as the leaders come back towards us through New Pub. Down they come, through the chicane they will head. Still all to play for. As they all breeze into chaos corner, Thompson, Thompson on the inside, Fiddler has gone back one more, Caden Thompson, doesn't want to let Kaiser Suffolk get away, Caden Thompson, he is not going to let Kaiser go, Kaiser will not get away but Fiddler, oh Fiddler nearly looked, he had to have the door closed on him, Thompson just had to move over to the left. Well, I'll tell you what, Vidler, he was coming straight back through and he was going to take no prisoners. On they go through better bends. Back towards us, they come. Still this trio not sorted out at the front. Do not take your eyes off it. Michele Mysterier will have the eye view. He will get the golden view of what goes on. And well there, he's gone back to second. Wells has gone back to second, from end to third, Platten, he's gone to the front, Lucky Platten, he's steamed through to the front, and now Wellesley hot on the brakes, through they come, through pit corner, on to Costa, still they go, and Bromhead right behind him, and Wells is looking over the left shoulder, Wellesley into better pens, it is not sorted yet, on we come, down back towards us, into New Pub. Still four laps left, and now the trio's changed. It's all about face, because Lockie Platten has gone in front. And Wellesley is right behind him. And still behind them, Kaiser and Thompson, Fiddler and Peacock, right on their tail, all the way through Pub. Greenhouse has finally got the job done, and Cody Anderson they head down into oh, Kaiser! Kaiser up the inside, so does Fiddler! Thompson back to Fiddler's holding on, is he? Yes, he is! Fiddler gets through. Kaiser to oh, Thompson, hand off the steering wheel. Not a happy chappy. Now they come through Broderick's the right hander. Now they're into better pens. The leaders, though, back towards us already. And it is still Platten, Wellesley, Bromet, then Licker Lima Sunier, then Santin, then Kaiser, Fiddler, Thompson, Peacock. Then it's going to be O'Day. Jaden O'Day.
Day trying to get with those just in front. Then it's Green off goes through. And finally Anderson. Through he goes. On they go down that front straight away. Sinking straight. Into pit corner. All gone through nicely and Suffolk! Oh, Vidler and Suffolk! Very nearly came together, but oh, Vidler has been on the curb! And Peacock goes through! Peacock finally gets one of them! He's been making a watching brief the entire time they've been at each other. Finally he picks one off! And now Platter has gone away from it! Has gone in front of Wellesley! And still this is going on! Peacock! He is on the move! Next up, will he get past Thompson? Last lap, they are just starting! Down they go, into Electro! Through pit corner with the leader, Lockie Platten from Bromad, from Wellesley, from Lima Surrier, from Santin. Then it's Suffolk, Thompson and Peacock right with them. Then Fiddler, then it's Jaden Ote, then Greenos, and then it's Cody Anderson going through pit corner right now. The leaders though come back through the chicane for the last time into Chaos Corner with the flying number 56 of Lockie Platten. They have gone through pass for the last time and it is a win the 56 Lockie Platten fist pump. Oh what happened to Bo? He coasted over the line. He just got second. Oh boy, oh boy, that was close. So Platten gets the win. Bromhead second. Wellesley gets third. Limassourier fourth. Santin fifth. Kaiser Suffolk sixth. Caden Thompson seven. Connor Peacock eight. Harrison Vidler nine. Jaden O'Day ten. Jackson Greenhouse in eleventh. And Cody Anderson rounds it out with twelfth. Great job from the kids. Gave us a great race yet again. And it was a cracker. Well done to little...